Tired of these errors? They just pop up every single time you open an application. But today in this video, I'm back with another fix. And today, we're gonna be fixing up this 230, 8 or 7, I don't know, error using command prompt. Just simple lines. Let's get started. So if you're facing these errors, what you literally need to do is to head over to your desktop. Well, that's every goddamn time you open up your desktop. Okay, type in CMD. Um, you also need to open as an administrator because we're going to be using the command prompt command shell for solving of this problem. It doesn't really matter. Now, if you're a 32-bit system user or a 32-bit system operator or whatever architecture your computer is, 32-bit, 64-bit, doesn't matter. The first thing you need to do is to register the DLL inside of command prompt now what problem we're getting here due uh, the problem that you're getting error code 2308 or whatever it's like that's due to because windows yeah, the vb shell script has been corrupted inside of windows so you need to re-register the dll so that can run properly how you can do that is to type in regs vr32 this is the probably a module command from which you can register dls so you can see there are a lot of commands you can do um, so really what we need to do is to go to regsvr32 type in vbscript script dot dll and press enter and that's gonna say dll register server in vbscript dll succeeded now there are few things we need to do more if you are a 64-bit system user there are few things you need to do extra if you're 32 bit you need not to worry the, all my uh, those sounds are produced by my brother sorry for that so um here we are and we need to switch up to 64 bits so how you can do it we are having a just just wait for it there are a lot of files inside of system 30 i think i'm not inside of system 32 oh crap i'm inside of system 30 just stop it i press ctrl c to stop it okay so literally where i am is system 32 i'm going to type in cd let's see c and i'm going to type in windows you need to type the same also if you're a 64 system user then only you need to type this SYSWOW64 press enter that's gonna be now you're gonna be inside of 64 it's called SYSWW64 if you have watched my previous videos how you can fix that Fortnite issue so this issue is also related to Fortnite and Epic Games launch issue so you can literally go off with these the same we're gonna type in here we're gonna type in REGSVR32 now what I, how I did that I pressed the arrow keys on my keyboard the above arrow key for rerouting the commands that are previously entered if you have closed the command prompt this would work so i pressed it like that maybe i cls so what we need to type is reg svr 32 and type in vbscript script dot dll press enter and that's gonna say dll register server and vb script dot dll succeeded now having that done what you need to do is to restart your computer once not useful or maybe not required but i do recommend you guys to restart it just for once and also next thing would be to try out application that has been causing issues for you so that would be it for today i hope that you like this small video i just made it in a second because i was getting that response from someone of you so i do hope uh, your issues are solved now so that would be it for today if you're having any problem make sure that you comment down below also hit this give this video a big thumbs up make sure to subscribe hit the subscribe button also hit that bell notification icon that would be it for the next service from fuzzy tech signing out